Hi guys, BTEC here. Today I'm going to show you how to upscale anime, or any movie, to your screen's resolution using lossless scaling. Plus, I'll also show you how to enable frame generation for buttery smooth frame rates. Before we begin, you'll need to get the lossless scaling software. I've already made a detailed video on how to use it for gaming, so if you're interested, click on the pop-up or check the link in the description. You'll also need a good video player like KM Player, which allows us to check check the original resolution of the video. Don't worry if this sounds confusing. You'll see exactly how it works in a moment. Step 1. Checking the video resolution. Now let's get started. I have an anime movie here, but as you can see, it's in fairly low resolution. To check the exact resolution in KM Player, simply press the Tab key. It will display the live video details. In this case, the anime is in 480p resolution. To make sure we're working with the original size, press 2 on your keyboard. This resizes KM Player to the video's native resolution. Now, this is how a 480p video looks on a 1080p monitor. Step 2. Upscaling with lossless scaling. Next, open up the lossless scaling application. Here, you'll find the Scaling section, where you can choose different upscaling methods. For 2D anime and animated content, I recommend either. Nearest Neighbor. This creates a sharp but pixelated look, which some people may prefer. Anime 4K. This provides a cleaner, high-quality upscale without pixelation, making it look more natural. If you're unsure, I suggest going with Anime 4K for the best results. Step 3. Choosing the right size and settings. For optimal quality, if you're upscaling to 1080p, set the size to large. If you're upscaling to 4K, try very large or ultra large for even better quality. If you're using KM Player, you'll also need to adjust the cropping settings to get a full screen view. Otherwise, your video might look off-center. To fix this, go to the Crop Input section in Lossless Scaling and crop 30 pixels from the top, crop 70 pixels from the bottom. And that's it. Now, your anime or movie is upscaled to full screen with a clean, high-quality look. Now, if you want to add frame generation, here's how to do it. Go to the LSFG lossless scaling frame generation section and set the type to LSFG 3.0. For the mode, I recommend setting it to 5x or higher if you have a 120Hz or higher refresh rate display. However, in my opinion, frame generation doesn't work well with anime because it tends to remove the creator's artistic style. Also, while anime technically runs at 24fps, the actual animation frames are often closer to 5fps, which can cause weird motion artifacts when using frame generation. Now that we've covered anime upscaling, let's move on to regular movie upscaling. For this, I'll be using FSR, Fidelity FX Super Resolution, as the upscaling method. Keep the other settings as they are. Unlike anime, frame generation works really well with regular movies, making motion feel much smoother. When enabled, it generates additional frames, resulting in a silky smooth experience. To enable frame generation, simply press Ctrl Alt S. This shortcut will instantly activate FG. Now, as you can see, the movie is not only upscaled, but also incredibly smooth. To finish off, I'll show a side-by-side -side comparison of the movie with and without frame generation, so you can see the difference for yourself. For the best experience, watch this video in 60fps, but trust me, in real life, it feels even smoother. And that's it for this video. If you found it helpful, hit the like button, subscribe, and turn on notifications for more content like this. Let me know in the comments what you think, and I'll see you in the next one.